Hi students, this is Kumar, your Max teacher, grade 7. Today, let us learn about the new chapter, Data Handling. Data, the information collected in terms of numbers is called a data. The information collected in terms of numbers is called a data. Data are represented graphically to have a quick glance on them. The next one is observation. Each numerical figure in the set of data is called an observation. Each numerical figure in the set of data is called an observation. The next one is raw data. Observation gathered initially are called a raw data. Observations gathered initially are called a raw data. The next one is array. Arranging in numerical figures of a set of data in ascending or descending order is called an array. Arranging numerical figure of set of data in ascending or descending order is called an array. The next one is frequency. In a given data, the number of times particular observation occurs is called a frequency. In a given data, the number of times a particular observation occurs is called its frequency. A table showing the frequencies of various observation of the given data is called a frequency distribution table or simply a frequency table. A table showing the frequencies of various observations of the given data is called a frequency distribution table or simply a frequency table. When the number of observations is large, we make use of tally marks to count the frequencies. When the number of observations is large, we make use of tally marks to count the frequencies. Tallies are usually marked in the bunches of 5 to make counting easier. Tallies are usually marked in the bunches of 5 to make the counting easier. Next one is range. The difference between the highest and lowest observations in a set of data is called its range. The difference between the highest and the lowest observation in a set of data is called its range. So difference means subtract. So subtract highest value minus lowest value. So therefore the range is equal to highest value minus lowest value. Now let us see the example of range. Find the range of the following data 14, 6, 12, 17, 21, 10, 4 and 3. So first we have to write the question in ascending order. So ascending order means smallest number to biggest number. So the smallest number is 3, then 4, then 6, then next 10, 12, 14, 17 and 21. So in the given data, the highest value is 21. So highest value is 21. The smallest value is 3. So range, find the range of the following data. So range is equal to highest value minus lowest value. So range is equal to highest value minus lowest value. So the highest value is 21 minus lowest value is 3. So 21 minus 3 is equal to 18. So therefore range is equal to 18.